Hi, this is Michelle with Scrap Craft Tastic, and I'm here to do Wednesday's haul, so let's get to it. I'm going to start with Walmart. Years ago, someone gave me this Letcher Tag label maker. Um, it's one of the old style ones. So, I, had been, I haven't really used it a lot, and then I've started using it more and more recently. And I needed some new tape. The first time I needed tape, I did order it from Amazon, but I was just browsing around at Walmart. So I found these um, clear labels and then this is plastic. I'm not sure that this is going to work with this. The cartridges look the same as what's in here. Let's just open it right here. So I don't know, um, like this one is paper. I don't know about this plastic, but I'm going to experiment and find out. And these are what, this is what I use to label my Happy Planner uh, sticker books. So if you... Um, so, for instance, like this one here. This book doesn't actually have a name, so it was just called 1234. So I use it to label. And this time when I do my labels, I will be adding glue because they are starting to peel up on the ends. So I'm just going to add glue to make them stick better. But anyway, so I was able to find these at Walmart. I don't remember the price. I've had them for a while and just forgot to share that with you. Then also from Walmart, I picked up some more of the new pen and gear stationery items. They actually have this printable glitter paper. I have not tried it yet, um, but it does say print me shed free. So it doesn't shed. So and in this pack, you get 10 sheets, 5 silver, 5 gold. So this is the gold and this is the silver. And I got a couple of packs of that. And then I also got the, this one is white. Um, I don't know if you, you can even see the shimmer on there. But it does have a shimmer. And this is 10 sheets. And it also says it's 104 pounds. So I think that's pretty heavy. And I got two of those. Now let's, I'm going to take one of these white ones out just to have a look at it. And maybe um, it says it's printable in inkjet and home printers. So we'll see. I just want to check the weight. Okay. So hopefully you can see that. Um, it's a nice weight. I would say it's a little heavier than the Michael 65 pound cardstock and I think it just curls like this because of whatever the treatment is on the paper to add the glitter but it has a nice luxurious feel it doesn't feel cheesy or cheap and thin it's a nice weight so and again I don't remember the price let me see if there's a receipt in the bag I tend to yeah, I didn't leave the receipt in the bag, so so I don't know remember the price, but it was fairly inexpensive. I mean it is Walmart, so there's that. Then also I got a pack of this blue copy paper. It's 20 pound paper, so it's not the best quality, but it was a nice color and I just kind of like to have different colors and options in my stash. And I already had the pink paper from, I think it was back to school last year. So I got the blue and I also got this lavender or purple color. This is what it looks like. I've already started using the blue. So, and that's a hundred sheets. Again, I don't remember the price but it was fairly inexpensive so those are all um, papers from pen and gear then moving on to joanne i went back to check on the wrong wrong stuff just to see if they got anything more um i didn't go for the holiday weekend which i probably should have and i did learn that they do get trucks in at my store on Thursdays and that the stock is usually out by Friday afternoon so that was good to know um, 
but I was able to pick up the half sheets, the wrong wrong half sheets, which I really didn't want too much more than this. I don't want a new planner. I just kind of wanted the girls, and I know there's some controversy about why the Happy Planner did this and the way they did it, but I'm going to stay out of that. <laughs> I just thought they were cute, and I don't know. I just like them. I, I, I just like them, so I got them. These are just the half sheets, and this is what the design looks like. It's just a lined paper, nothing fancy just basic simple and then even though I'm not using my happy planner to plan I do use them as notebooks so I got the happy notes mainly because of the cover I don't need the paper that's inside of it really um, let's see if I can open this up I'm just gonna cut this on the bottom So, oh, I want to hold on to that. I have a use for those now. Um, so I just basically wanted it for the cover. And I may go back and get another cover style that they have. I mean, if you have a good coupon, which I did, um, plus the lady at the, that checked me out gave me another coupon that made my price is even better so but if you have a good coupon then it's worth it to get this for the cover I'm not sure exactly how much just a happy planner cover costs by itself but if you're using a disc bound system of this size or you want to make your own planner this is a good place to start with the happy notes because they're fairly inexpensive and then you can do your printable inserts and make it your own so which is a good way to use it so I'll come back and get the rest of the sticky stuff off so I got this cover there's one other cover that I like that I may go back and scoop up I don't know um, I'm gonna go ahead and look at the inside too in case you haven't seen this bright days ahead so it does come with dividers So there's that one. There's this one. It's just got your polka dots there. Florals and stripes. Some more of the girls. And then that's it. So, yep, you just get the dividers, and this one is dot grid paper. Again, you can do printable inserts, make it turn it into a planner, however you want to do it, or just use it as a notebook. So, and again, it's worth it just for the covers. Um, and I think that was it from Joanne. Moving on to Michael's. I watch Liz for a day, every day, at 6 o'clock when she's on. And I already had a set of these um, that I think I ordered from May May Made It. A while ago and they, they also are available on Amazon but Recollections has these clickable letter set this is what it looks like they click together so you can make words and I saw that Liz was able to find these at Michael's so I went and checked and I was able to find them as well and I wanted a different font the font that I have is more of a handwritten font so this is a serif font and it's all caps and these are the letters that you get and then they just click together like this so you can just take them apart and make whatever words you want and stamp so I use these in my plan with me videos quite a bit to do the days of the week but you can use them for pretty much anything to build your words they come in this box I don't know if I want to keep them in here I don't know, worry about that but yeah these are $19.99 which is very expensive um, the regular price but I use the coupon 
and then I had another coupon for 25% off so I think I had a 50% off coupon and then a 25% off of that coupon I also picked up something from the new Happy Planner um, school back to school release which they have the sticker books out already for back to school I got the teacher book and the student book just these two there's quite a few other teacher and student books but these were the two that I wanted because they had the seasonal stuff in them so I'm just going to flip through real real quick summer break it had all the break information then just some labels or headers and you would think that I, this is what I thought when I first saw them that I, I don't need these these are just school related but they are more than just school related so they're pretty general I mean you do have some homework in here paper test quiz but not a lot very little of that so this is spring we're moving into the fall section the first one was summer by the way that summer <laughs> um, then there's fall and then winter so it's just the different seasons um, and I like that they were not traditional colors completely that was what I said okay let me grab that especially fall it has some really, a really nice color scheme for fall so there's that one I feel kinda cheated because it only has 577 pieces but because it's seasonal I'll overlook that this one is the teacher it has more teacher related stuff in the back than the rest of the book so it's got just the black and then it's got the silver foil And here we get into the seasonal stuff. There's the winter, Christmas, um, Halloween, and fall. And then this back to school, summer, spring, Valentine's Day and some birthday stickers and then some more gold foil word stickers and then this is just the holidays so again this is like two seasonal books even though they're student teacher um, they're still seasonal and you can use them even if you're not a student or a teacher okay so that is everything that I've got from Michael's so on a trip to Joanne, just a spur of the moment trip, um, I was actually looking for a zipper, but I didn't like the prices <laughs> of the zippers. Um, I just strolled through the paper crafting section and the punches were on sale for 30% off. So I was just looking at those. I had a few in mind that I wanted, but I was just waiting to get a good price. So I actually found a few that were on clearance and they were of dies that I actually wanted. So I picked them up and I got them for a really good price on clearance. And the Joanne that I shop at, they don't actually have just a clearance section. The clearance items are usually mixed in with everything else and they'll have a red sticker. So that's how you know in the store that I shop at that they are on clearance and they were not part of the sale. So the first one that I got is this large butterfly. And this is what it punches. Then I got a small butterfly. I didn't have I don't have any butterfly punches other than the little teeny tiny 
butterfly punch so I wanted butterfly punches and I've been eyeing them and just pretty much too cheap to buy one so again that's what it punches and these work really good and they're easy on my hands because if you've been watching my plant with me videos you know I've been having a little issue with my hands I think it's cleared up now but I still want to take it easy on my hands and then the last one that I got is this small heart I have again I have a real teeny tiny heart that's like confetti size but I didn't have anything bigger I would like a bigger heart but they didn't have that one on clearance so I'll just wait patiently until I can get a good price but I got all three of these for $21 and if you know anything about punches you could get a punch maybe this size that costs 18 to $20 just by itself and that could be even with a sale price it's still that expensive so I think I got a really good deal basically I got three for what I would pay for one big one so that's it for this week's Wednesday's haul I hope you like videos like this if you do please give me a thumbs up make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so that you receive notifications each time I upload a new video be sure to let me know what you think about this haul below if you have any comments or questions please leave those below Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.